Hi there, my name is Samuel Golden and I am going to help you get a 100% on your private pilot written exam. Here at King Schools, we send a free ACE hat to anyone who uses our ground school course, then passes an FAA knowledge test with a perfect score. So without further ado, here's eight powerful tips to get a perfect score, then a sweet hat. Let's get started. First and foremost, when it comes to studying for a written exam, you don't want to cram, you want to understand. The FAA no longer publishes questions from the test, so more than ever, you need to know the concepts so you can answer the questions correctly, no matter how they're worded. Plus, one day soon, you'll be a pilot, and once you are, you may have an unexpected situation in flight. In that moment, knowing that the answer was B to a particular question will not help you, but understanding the why behind the knowledge will. Also, during your check ride, your examiner is required to make sure you understand the knowledge with emphasis on everything that you missed on your written exam. Make no mistake, they will dig in to make sure you truly understand each concept. If you're prepared, this is no big deal. Okay, next tip for a perfect score is choosing the right ground school and test prep. Look for ground schools with strong reputations, updated content, and resources that support learning with video lessons, quizzes, flashcards, and practice exams. There are plenty of great online platforms, but of course, I'm partial to King Schools. We have helped generations of pilots pass the tests, so we know a thing or two about ground schools and test prep. If you want to see for yourself, check out our free private pilot sample course in the description so you can personally experience our teaching style. Next tip is number three. Even with a great ground school, you might find some areas where you need extra resources. That's where the FAA's material comes in handy. They publish plenty of resources that can deepen your knowledge, such as the Pilot's Handbook of Aeronautical Knowledge and the Airplane Flying Handbook. If you plan to use more than one or two extra resources, though, I'd recommend you check out King's Online Library. In that package, we give you a whopping 85 resources for $79. This bundle is included in all King Schools bundles, but if you don't have it, I'll put a link in the description. Okay, moving right along. Tip number four is to take handwritten notes. As old school as it may sound, it has been scientifically proven that writing things by hand can increase your understanding and retention of the material. And that's saying a lot coming from a guy that has the handwriting of a first grader, me. <laughs> For its tip number five, make test prep your best friend. As you complete each lesson, you will take relevant FAA style questions to get used to them and ensure you learn the material. Then once you get to the end of your ground school, if you're using King, you'll use the free King Test Prep Companion Apps flashcards with over 600 review questions to help really lock down your knowledge. Then last, you'll take full practice exams. I recommend you take as many random practice exams as you can, there's unlimited on King, as this will train you for the real thing. Once you start consistently scoring 85% or higher on those practice exams, you're ready for the big day. Tip number six is visualization. I've mentioned this technique before on this channel, but it bears repeating. If you get test day jitters, like me, it will be very helpful to spend a few minutes a day in visualization. It's very simple. Sit down in a quiet place, put your phone on airplane mode, and visualize yourself answering the questions in the testing center with a relaxed confidence. Remember to visualize yourself performing flawlessly though, because practice doesn't make perfect, it actually makes permanent. Do this enough and your brain will know exactly what to do during the real exam. Next tip is about the day before your exam. Don't actually study on this day because you've already done the hard work. Instead, focus on taking care of yourself. Rest, drink a lot of water, eat quality meals, and ensure that you are physically ready to perform at your best. Hydration and good food have been scientifically proven to boost brain function, so this is more important than you may think. The analogy I like to use here is a man in the forest cutting down a tree. 
If he first takes the time to sharpen his axe, he will be much better off than if he hacked away at the tree with a dull axe all day. Don't be a dull axe and stay sharp. Okay, one last tip. As you take your questions, you'll be referred directly to figures. Those figures will be given to you on the day of the exam in a test supplement book. However, don't just glance at the figure that the question refers to, flip through the figures and understand them fully. In addition to the figures, the testing supplement also contains a gold mine in the chart legends. They're never referred to directly by questions like the figures are, but they do contain the answers to many questions. There will be lots of legend information, so spend some time familiarizing yourself with it. The legends are truly a free gift from the FAA to use during your test, and not many people use it. Okay, folks, that is all. Follow these tips, study hard, and give us a call when you get 100% on your test. We'll be glad to send you your ace hat. We'll talk to you then.